This is Edgecombe College in the Bay of Plenty and we've got an Okafen 260 kilowatt pellet boiler system which is heating the entire college. Edgecombe College has an Okafen 260 kilowatt system which is made up of two pairs of 130 kilowatt boilers which in turn are made up of two modules of 65 kilowatts and we've got a huge modulation range so the peak output of the system is 260 kilowatts the slowest output is 19 kilowatts so that's like a modulation range of from 100% down to about 7% and each one has its own fuel feed up at the top here at this school we've got a 4 auger system that can hold at least 12 tonnes which is a full truckload so they get best value when the pellets are delivered. You saw outside there are delivery points where the truck pop, uh, plugs in the hose, blows the pellets into the store. What we can't see is behind this wall it's a lined plywood box essentially that we've converted from the coal store and there are four augers here at the bottom, one for each boiler giving maximum level of redundancy and flexibility. You can see into the pellet store here where there's a slope of pellets. These are ones left over from the heating season and then the gives you a visual guide to what's going on. We've also got sensing for the amount of pellet that's left so the boilers can tell us when the fuel store needs to be refilled. Previously this school had a coal boiler and they were burning 50 tonnes of coal a year every winter which is a huge amount of carbon emissions, um, the equivalent of many thousands of kilometres of travel for all the students here just by coming to school. Since putting in the Orkafen pellet boiler and some minor changes in the school, last winter the school only used 25 tonnes of wood pellets. So the comparison between coal and wood pellets, already it's a 99% reduction in carbon dioxide emissions with coal versus wood pellets, but we've also managed to halve the total consumption of fuel with this modern efficient system. The Okafen system's heating the entire college through radiators and a few fan coil units, and it's divided into a number of different blocks um, which are slowly being upgraded and the pipework will be replaced, the emitters will be replaced as the school has quite a big upgrade, but this boiler will be here for the next 25-30 years.